Hello fellow makers, enthusiasts and those of you who came here looking for answers. I'm Jan and today I'm going to show you how to add text to a curved surface in Fusion 360. Welcome back. Let's get right to it, shall we? As we can see in this example, I've got both embossed and engraved text on the sphere. Now, when I was first starting out, all the tutorials I read were really complicated, saying you need to go into this sheet metal workspace or some different workspace and do about a dozen steps to get this. But what I'm going to show you is a lot simpler. First, start by creating a new document and sketching out a circle. Stop sketch. Extrude this out to form a cylinder. And add text with the text tool. Now, this is important. You have to find a plane which is inside your circle. Just place the text basically anywhere. We can move it around later and type. And sometimes it comes out upside down, but with these simple flip buttons, we can just realign it and everything's perfect. Now we have the text here. We go to create and extrude, and here's where the magic happens. Instead of selecting the original profile plane, we select from object. And then all you need to do is just give it a value to either engrave it or emboss it. And here we can already see it's engraved along the curve absolutely perfectly. And that's really how simple it is. Now, if you want to emboss it, you do exactly the same thing. So from object, select it, and then just give it a value, this time positive. Or you can pull it out like this to get the amount you want. It's a bit too much, and there we are and hit OK, and you have some text coming out of the object following that curve absolutely perfectly. That's really just how simple it is. Now, say you want to have an object which had more than one curve, or a curve in more than one direction. So let's just quickly sketch out something. Select your plane, draw a couple of lines, not that way here let's do kind of a button or coin shape something that most people start out designing as maker coins these days and just revolve the shape along the green axis and here we go we have our button and we'll want to put text along the side of this button so it's got basically two curves and the text is going to follow both and it's just as simple as before you have to select your plane and this is important again that you have it in the same direction as you want the text then to be going and again we're upside down doesn't matter just flip it around and actually here you can see now why we're upside down for this one Sometimes it's not quite that clear, but this time it was. Just resize the text a little bit, place it in the correct position, hit OK, and again, just extrude. Try to get a better angle here. From object, select the coin button as we're calling it this time and there we go it's coming off the surface or sorry engraved into the surface here and again if you give it the opposite value then you'll have it embossed on top this is really how simple this is That's all from me for now. I hope this tutorial helped you and you get to designing more awesome things. Thanks for watching, and if you liked it, please do give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and do subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. I'm Jan, this has been Today I Made, thanks. <laughs>